Right, so the objects that I would include in an interview photographs to illustrate my practice, that being a visual artist, would be a paintbrush. Um, certainly if I had some paintings that were on the go, not necessarily finished paintings, but paintings that are in the works, that's what I would include. The function of change um, for me is having different people in here. So I'm not one of the artists who just can have, you know, solitude and be by myself. I like to have different people come through that I can get different ideas, different perspectives from. Currently I'm working, well, I'm working, I'm gonna exhibit a series that I worked on for years. And what I'm working on is another series, which is right behind me. And I call that Finding Order and Chaos. And it's sort of a pandemic series where, yeah, it's, it's about consumerism. It's about um, coming to terms with the situation. Yeah, and so to do that, I'm representing uh, cars, cars that are have been demolished, that have been left behind and destroyed. And I'm trying to sort of find the beauty in that destruction. To be honest, I don't have that many items that have stayed with me for a long time. I, I'm always evolving and adapting to the circumstances. So wherever I'm working, I'll usually sort of have tools around that. But certainly my paintbrushes, they're ever evolving, but even for them, you know, like this one, it used to be really nice, but in its old age, it has another purpose, you know? So, so the brushes, they go through multi stages of usefulness. So I, I, would, I would say paint brushes again. Well, it, it's not so much an item, but I always have a cart beside me. I'm, I'm big on my mobile carts. So I have a, a mobile drawing cart, now I have a mobile printmaking cart and this is my mobile painting cart. So I sort of, wherever I'm working, I'm gonna have a cart beside me as sort of a workstation. Personal space for me is more inside my head um, because I'm, I can work in public, I can work with other artists, I can collaborate. So personal space is more of a mental thing. Physically, I like that to always be moving and shifting and to have different people come through my physical space. Uh, so personal, I don't actually have that much personal space. And I don't, I don't need it or want it.